so let's start with uh, the train test split part okay so these are the uh, features that we will be needing to predict our target case okay let's create out some new cells name this as train test split train test split and let's call train test split so from sklearn dot model selection okay. model selection import train test split just fine everything is just fine now what i'm going to do is first of all i'm going to take my x and then i'm going to take my y what is my x x is equal to salary of this i need all these features and at y okay i will be needing salary at the target Okay, we have got x and y. Let's do print test split. I'll copy the example as I always do. Okay, so here is my example. Paste it out. Let's put it out in a single line. And let's keep 30% of our data set. 30% of our data set. Let's keep random state 42. If you want the same answer as mine, let's do it. You have x train, x test. Okay, if you want to take check x train, okay, this is x train and this is just fine, right? So 30% of our data set that is 21,000, that is 70% of our data set is in x train and in x test we have 30 30% uh, 30%, right? The split is so let's check x test. Its test is almost 9216. Quite right, right? So we have splitted our data set between test split, training, and testing part. Now, what I need to do is I need to train my model. So here is where my uh, training of model begins. So this is our first ever SBM uh, model. So let's create training. Okay, model train. So let's import from sklearn again. We are going to import svm import. Okay, from sklearn.svm import svc capital svc. Okay, uh, there's a typo. Yeah, so successfully we have imported. Now let's call classify. Let's create an object for the svc class. Hmm. successfully we have created now what are the next steps so we have done the train test split okay uh, into 70 30 ratio and then we have called out the svc class that is which is having all the code that we need to uh, fit our model and we have created an object for that particular class that is of svc class we have created an object now what are the next steps that we need to do the next steps are we need to fit our model and uh, then eval do the evaluation part okay so to fit our model what i'm going to do is to write classifier dot fit and then pass x test x test and then i'm going to pass y test it will take quite a few seconds to train complete our training and completely we have completed our training so we have created our first ever model okay first ever svm model so let's start with the prediction and the evaluation part so let's jump into the next video and start with the prediction and the evaluation part and some of the problems of why we are getting that kind of score